hello folks in this video I would like to to talk about uh, some topics here my channel has has been for a long time very poor of subscribers and views and I began this this gardening videos because I want to help people to 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 share my experience with them and to most importantly learn from them so living in a country when you are unemployed can be very well it's it's not easy I've been trying to grow my my own food at home to to help with the sparing money and and you have to spare money with other things and well I'm trying to do my best to spare money I have worked um, you know here when you are unemployed usually you can find um, daily works where you work the whole day and they pay you around uh, twelve dollars for your day of work it's not much but it, it can help and it does help and well in a world where uh, cauliflower head costs one dollar twelve a day is, is not that little and it can help I can buy gas and pay the electricity bills and we do what we can and, and that's why I began this channel because I want to share my experience I want to make my own food forest sell my my grafted plants sell my flowers sell the things seedlings of whatever plant I can grow here to help myself and maybe in the future produce some kind of sustainable business that I can keep without depending on the economic situation of my country so I do what I can and I will keep doing I hope you like the videos in my channel I plan to making more of them to show you the things to show you how we, we grow cassava plants and they, they keep us healthy and alive during bad economic times and well you know life you have to fend for yourself and make the most of what you have it's not always easy so I have found this page on the web that, that shows you things about the, the weather where you live how humid it is what's the growing season for different places of the world I found it to be very interesting when we are curious about where another person lives how they grow their food how the weather is there and about the rain and the heat snow cold periods I found it to be very interesting this is those are the data and it's not specifically in the city where I live but it's the neighboring city so you can see for yourself what the growing pattern is for for the heat and for the plants and stuff I found it to be very interesting um, you have seen the videos of my plants you can see how how they are doing relative to the weather in the moment 